This is Dapu7. With everything going on here on planet Earth, there are a few things that have been talked about here recently involving the moon that has kind of slid by everyone. I want to point this out and talk about some of the details here about these spheres, these perfectly round, smooth, and see-through glass balls that they're saying that they have discovered on the dark side or far side of the moon. Now, China has been up there with a rover for some time. And interestingly enough, that same rover that they originally launched had a background image showing a mushroom cloud coming from the area of Ukraine. Well, they're now talking about these beads or these spheres that they've discovered up there. And it reminds me of talk that went on a few years back. It was covered on Coast to Coast AM and other sites talking about the Chinese lunar images. And they were talking about the raw images, not the photoshopped, cleaned up ones that they were trying to present. They were saying that when you took off all the filters, something was going on. That there seems to be, what they were saying, is almost a translucent glass dome or glass domes structures on the moon that from far away you would never be able to see even with the telescope because you would see right through them. There's been a lot of back and forth about this. But then even in the Apollo missions, this is where it starts to really get interesting. They too, when you take out all the filtering, were showing something up there. There was something that is there, almost like a dome structure made of what they were saying is like a silica type of substance or glass type of substance and they go on and on here showing the examples of this right here this is another shot you can see by looking and i'll show you this is the cleaned up one versus what was originally all there and they're saying you know what is all this that we keep getting in all these images that they're trying to clean up and take out of the images what is that and for some time now, they've been saying that they believe that it is glass or glass structures. Now, all of a sudden, they're trying to tell you there's little glass balls being discovered all over the area. They try to give their stupid little excuses, you know, these days, but obviously they lie through their teeth about everything. But they have to, to tell us the truth in these weird ways dropping breadcrumbs and telegraphing them. Even for their big events, it's the same way. I just thought that this was interesting and there may be a connection between the two. They want to say maybe it was a meteor that impacted. Maybe. But prove it. I mean, it's all theory at this point. But what makes their theory any more valid than ours when they've been caught lying a zillion times? But yet some people are just going to go out there and run with whatever they say. <laughs> Idiots. You at least got to use discernment, right? That's what we try to do. And be prepared. They're going to hit the moon here again with another object. And for those that have the right instruments out there, you can listen when they do this. And you can hear how the moon, just like the last two times they did this, it reverberates like a bell, meaning it is hollow in nature. Very interesting. Makes you wonder about the planet, huh? I'll leave links. Join me for the live streams going live Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 9 p.m. Eastern. Breaking this down further. Censorship free. Eyes to the skies.